Hey everybody, I am standing here with Mitchell Freem and I bet you can't guess where I'm at. You can't, I'm gonna tell you. We're here at the Dime Exchange. Mitchell? Dime Store. Dime Store, why did dime I say store, Dime Store? Dime Store, The Dime store. store, there's a Dime Store downtown Detroit. This is the second one. And Mitchell's one of the owners here. Here, and we have a great location here, right up at Tinkin, next to Papa Joe's. Yeah, yeah. Right, so this is our uh, interview with uh, Mitchell, did you know him? and uh, the dime store. So Mitchell, yes, tell sir. us a little bit about yourself, how you got in the, the industry. I uh, appreciate you guys having me. Um, you know, dime store has been around for about 10 years. We have our first location in downtown Detroit. Uh, you know, we grinded through COVID and we were finally ready to open up our second location. And we came out to Rochester Hills here. Uh, there was a couple things that kind of sold us. We connected to Papa Joe's grocery store. It's uh, just an amazing collaboration and thing to happen. Uh, and then I also had a couple of family members of my partners that live out here, love the city of Rochester Hills, um, been out here for about 25, 30 years. And the community around here, the, the, the mayor and everybody we've met with, they're all about small business and opening up small businesses. So we just felt kind of right at home and we figured that this was the perfect place for us. Yeah, that's great. What got you into the restaurant business, though? Did you grow up making uh, waffles in the morning you for know, your family? I, I've always loved cooking a little bit at home, but this is kind of actually a, a semi-newer thing for me. I, I've tried out a few other careers in the past that, that just didn't make me super happy inside. And, and I got into this industry about six years ago, and I just realized that I loved waking up every morning and, and coming into work and making other people happy through food, and that's what makes me happy inside. So five, six years ago, I just I, I realized that I loved doing it. I figured what better way than to maybe try to open up my own place one day, and, and here we are. Wow, that's that's fantastic. It's your passion, you can see the passion that comes through from Mitchell. I mean, your, your background here. And the store looks amazing. We've been in business now here for two or three weeks. For two weeks, we're on day 14. We, we, we did hire a, a designer that we used for the original one downtown Detroit, um, as well as a couple of different artists to do a few of the murals that you'll see while you're here. And uh, we just kind of wanted to bring a little bit of that Detroit vibe here to Rochester oh, Hills. Look at that. And uh, I think we accomplished that with some of the artwork and some of the employees that I hired. And yeah, like, so it so has that warehouse type space. But yeah, I love the back here next to Papa Joe's. So, let's cut to the chase here, obviously. <laughs> what are two of your signature dishes? We're gonna talk about them, right? You know, we yeah, a couple of the things that, uh, that that we seem to, I don't wanna say be famous for, but we get a lot of good Whoa. feedback. Look uh, at this. this is, is our, our duck bop hash. Duck bop hash. Um, it's a comfy duck leg that we all make in-house. Um, that we make with a Korean barbecue sauce again that we make everything's fresh here. We are a scratch restaurant But we got some pickled veggies some sriracha on top and it just gives it this good spicy, spicy sweet flavor. balance um, That is a different but delicious breakfast yeah. dish. That's that's hearty. Hey, you know, we, we, you're not gonna walk away here hungry I don't know. <laughs> we got some uh, fresh biscuits that we make some buttermilk biscuits that. that we make fresh every morning and side with some uh, strawberry jam that we make fresh as well. Very nice. This is our, our number one dish that sells most often. Uh, but we also do have... Oh, the swap, right? We also do have like a whole... We got the sweet tooth, right? We got the sweets too. Okay. Every month we do do some new chef specials. Um, on this month we do got a strawberry matcha waffle. So we got a malted waffle with a strawberry sauce that we make. Wow, look at that. Um, some fresh strawberries. What's matcha? Is matcha healthy for you? Mm -hmm. Matcha is healthy. It's okay. uh, it's used a lot in herbs, teas. Yeah, teas. I heard matcha so tea. We got this strawberry tea kind of thing going on, really, at the end of the day, and oh. we got a little uh, roasted, uh, shaved coconut on top oh, as very well. Nice. Like, very nice. Good dessert item. Yeah. Good. Good. People get it for their meal all the time, actually. So those are two of the signature items here. So your menu is a little different. Obviously, we got some competition here in downtown Rochester. So what sets you apart from some other stores you can say? Um, you know, I think at the end of the day, I believe that myself, George, who is my partner here, and our chef, Paris, we're foodies at the end of the day. We're, we're food people. And so we're trying to bring an elevated brunch here to Rochester Hills. Um, we've done that for 10 years in, in Detroit. And, um, we just try to take brunch to a, to a little bit of a next level. We're not really fine dining per se, but we're elevated. I love it. I love it. And your hours, 
You're Monday, are you, are you seven days a week? We're going to be seven days a week here to start. Okay. Um, we're eight to three eight every to three. day. Yeah. Uh, and George and myself will be here. And those, we'll see you. Someone will be here, yeah. Absolutely. So, hey, everybody, check out the dining store here in uh, just north of downtown Rochester. But, you know, next to Papa Joe's, then, you know, you can't miss it. Maybe you go shopping at Papa Joe's for your groceries. Come here, you know, for, for brunch afterwards or whatever. Yeah. Say hi to Mitchell, and uh, we'll see you soon. Appreciate it, guys.